going to hugging face and I'm going to create the same thing in my hugging face spaces. So go to spaces, create new space, first sentiment dot. Okay, streamlet. Our space SDK, we call it SDK or application uh, that is there, streamlet. Hardware, you will take the basic one. CPU, there are other more options, but only one free option is there. So we will take this, we will take, keep it public. We do create space. So this is our environment. So this is an environment. What we have to do is we have to think it of a as a, a, a same structure that we have here, folder structure. We need to create two folders. One is requirement and one is app. Very same folder structure. If people have used GitHub, they will understand the structure. So if I go to files, and this is very important. Uh, whenever we load this application, you need to, first thing is that you need to install the uh, app, uh, the packages. And that is why the first thing is we need to add the packages. So what we do, add file, create a new file. Then we need to uh, write the name of the file, requirement, requirements.txt. Uh, here we need to paste. I'm not going to code again because I coded already live. I already did a live coding here. So I will just copy paste all the packages that are required here. Okay. And before saving here, I'm going to write here. I am going to do a commit I, 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 and T. It means that this has to run first. Uh, initialize. We call it initialize. It has to run first and we do commit to main. So this is the first file. It is uh, that we have inside this requirement.txt. The next file will be. We go back to decoding uh, data science. Sorry, first sentiment bot. Uh, yes. And then we add a new file. We go to another file. Add one more file. And this file will be app. Our application that we have building, the main application file. And the main application file is going to have the same code that I, I wrote here. The same code that was working in my local. You need to copy paste it in your uh, hugging face spaces as well. Dot. Okay. Dot. App dot. Mistake, huh? Yeah, yeah, got it. Cool. Okay, thank you, thank you. So commit uh, di directly to the main branch. Okay, uh, first the requirement will work, then this will work. Let me now commit the new file to main, and uh, now let me go back to files. So I have these two files ready. This is the initial. Uh, the initial initialization is going to happen here. Then this app.py is going to run. Uh, how to run it? Go back to uh, this thing, and now click this. It will just take a couple of minutes for this to run. If I click this, you can see it is initializing the first uh, automatically when you open this file, it is what it is going to do is it is going to run the requirement of txt. And after that, so first time it is going to take so much time. After two minutes, I'm going to give you this link. Uh, it should, it is, this, is, this will be uh, ready. This will be uh, ready for use uh, for everyone without, and uh, this instance of this uh packages and all are going to be live and that is a good thing i don't know how they manage it but uh because the application that i sent to you sometime back right uh, on uh, the application i sent you i yesterday while preparing for this workshop i had created it yesterday and it is still working right you did, when you when you click that hugging space the one that i shared with you this one uh, it, it it will not always uh, when you click this it will not always uh, uh, run the libraries it has all it has already ran that library then it has created uh, that instance but first time when you have to do it 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 is it runs it and it creates that instance and uh, let me see here it just takes a couple of minutes it it uh, how this works is very interesting and this is the, the architecture that they use is amazing uh, and uh, this is a very good thing about spaces now suppose you build a project you build any use case like uh, this is a very simple project i want, i made but if you share it on your hugging face spaces and it is working well it is a it, it can be shared with anyone as an application you can add some more logic and you can make it more better as well so this is ready click building if you can see it is building so i will request every one of you the seven, six of you in this group to at least create the same code that i, I the same thing that i did to create uh, to create this uh, by yourself and put this link in the because here there is no uh, you can say excuse about open ai key but i have i don't have every one of you i request you to make your the same working bot 
under your hugging face faces and put it in the whatsapp group this is a request that i am telling everyone if you want to whatever i told you today you want to put it on practice i, I know it is very easy it just took me 10 minutes if you even if i share you the code i will share you the code and everything i'll put it on github and i will share it to you but i will request you to build it so at least every one of you can have your first hugging space spaces ready and you can uh, always build over this and uh, this is a very very important part i, I always tell everyone github is there and now hugging space spaces is the new uh, github for data scientists so i request all the six of you to please create you can put your own name here you can be as creative as you want to become and you can now i have got the bot so it is ready it is deployed i'm going to share you the everyone the link also so i have shared the link so within 10 minutes this bot is ready in front of you live with scratch code from scratch till uh, a running application deployed on the internet and uh, now satya left he got scared when i told him to create a uh, create a bot and put it on the group he left <laughs> that is okay and let me just test it out Hey Satya, you are back. I thought you got. I uh, when we talked about um, creating this uh, application and uh, you went missing. So I thought you got scared. Okay, see. So this application is there. Analyze and it is going to deploy. And you saw the speed, how fast it came. It was much faster than my local system. And I shared the code. Uh, I shared the link with you all of you in the group uh, as well. Satya, I hope you got the link. I'll share it again. This is our bot that we created. And we are getting a very good score also of 97.6% accuracy and which is very, very good. And now coming.